It's password. It's super password. Our special guest this week from Give Me a Break, Lori Hendler. And from Love Boat, Fred Grandy. And the star of Super Password, Bert Bundy. Hello, so good to see you. Hello. Hello there. Hello, everybody. Come sit. Join us. Off we go. Uh -huh. Welcome, everybody. Thank you for the welcome uh, to you, and uh, welcome to you at home to Super Password. Uh, this is a great week. I'm really enjoying this, and I hope you are, too, because we have, as I said before, two outstanding players, and I think you've seen that already. You guys are really good. No you kidding. You say that to all the players. I don't yes, say it to all the players. You watch every week. No, mm. but the fact is, you know, this show really works the best when our celebrities are not only attractive and all of that stuff, but really can play this game. And so we really tend to have people on who play very, very well. And you are, as I said, right up there at the top, and I like that. Oh, okay. Thank okay. you so much. Just say thank you. That's thank all you, Bert. Okay, you're welcome. Thank you, Bert. Any business Hi. we have to get, out, get done here or anything uh, that you'd like to talk about? Well, um, last Saturday on our show th that was just on, I made an announcement that I'm pregnant, and I would like to emphasize for anybody who might have any questions, only Julie Kaniski is pregnant. I'm not. You personally are not pregnant. I am not pregnant. <laughs> this is not being done to hide something. I just wanted to... Make sure that everyone knows that. Good idea, because you'll be getting letters. Yes. Is she really pregnant? And some that... tabloid to remain unnamed will probably say that I am anyway, but oh, I'm not. Oh, no, probably an article in People magazine. Not. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> They'll probably be calling me tomorrow. I'll give us the real story, Bert, yeah. you know? Absolutely. Fred, uh, are you pregnant or anything like that? No. No, I'm not, not even expecting it. Well, <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. No. Um, anything else you'd like to discuss with us, sir? Anything pertinent before we Isn't get on with this? Isn't it enough and I'm just here to play the game? It certainly you is. You always have something to pitch here? No, no, absolutely not. I just thought you might not have had something. Not Wheel of Fortune, you know. That's true, too. Here we go. <laughs> I'm a person. I have feelings. I just want to play. Okay, know? here comes Rosemary and Robert, then. Let's get on with it. Uh, so it's us, guys. Okay? Yes. Hi. How about this slide? Hi. Nice to see you, Rosemary. Thank you. Robert, nice to see you. And let's start with our challenger, Rosemary, who just got here and yes. needs to talk about uh, things and yes, win some well, money. Yes, my name is Rosemary Cheverini. I was born in the Bronx, New York. Hey. I've been here 16 years. I love tennis, classical music. And I just started a job with Los Angeles Philharmonic, so I am quite thrilled. Yes, that'll be yeah. very nice. It's very exciting. Yeah, are you a musician as well? No, no, I just listen with my ears. Listen with your ears. And I just love it. I just a good thing to listen with, otherwise. <laughs> it's my instrument. To listen right with here. your eyes, it's not nearly as good. Thank you, Rosemary. Robert is our current champion. He has $38,600. Yeah. I may have asked you before, Robert, what, what are you going to buy? Uh, tell me something you're going to buy. I always like to hear things that you're going to well, buy. Well, over the weekend, I did decide that the first thing I'm going to do is go home and see my family. Right. Because I haven't seen them in two years. They oh. live in Philadelphia. So that's number one. And then while I'm over that way, I think I'm going to just hop over to London or something. You know? yeah. That's another place I've always wanted to go. And never have. Never have. Well, would that be nice? Yeah. You can go first class, too. Mm. <laughs> well, I don't know. I yeah. might be a little frugal. Yeah, OK. You know? Well, that's great. No, no matter what, I like to hear people say, I'm going to go to London. I'm going to buy a car. I think you said that. Yeah, well, I, yes, I'm also going to do that. Might buy a car. Mm -hmm. you got enough money to do both of those I got one picked things. out. You do? Well, we can't talk about it here. You'll tell me later. <laughs> uh, Maybe if we mention it real nicely, they'll send us one. They don't do that anymore. No, the, the, no. the plug days are over in television, unfortunately. Uh, OK, where are we? Where do we stand? Uh, you have just won the, um, the $200 puzzle. Yes. Oh, right. uh, Robert is now leading $300 to zero for Rosemary. And it's time for your first magic toaster attempt. Yes. Oh, boy. There you are. Uh, show the folks toaster. at home uh, what the word is. Uh, the, the cash word is worth $1,000 today. You have three chances to convey this word to Robert. As you know, we're ready for clue number one, please, Laurie. Surrender. <sighs> Retreat. Clue number two. Game. War. All right, here we are. Third and final clue. Uh, surrender. Uh, wh uh, white flag, I don't know. Oh, gosh. Any, any ideas? Could Cancel. Cancel. You said game, which was good. Yeah, no Quit. show Ca was my thought. But that's no two show, words. but it's, that's the only thing I could think of. Uh, the word was forfeit. Oh. But of course. So, in a game, if you don't show or, or injury, you, uh, what were you thinking? 
Did you have one? No, no. no nobody Five did. Five fit, four fit, no. No, <laughs> no oh, please. Uh, <laughs> that's the way I think. That's why I don't play this game. The $2,000 will be uh, what the cash is worth next time, and with our score, $300 for Robert and zero for Rosemary. At this point, we will change partners and break away for a commercial. We'll come back and play some more. Uh, Hard work. Forfeit. Why, in a game. Here we are back, and uh, before we go any further, we would like to congratulate KBJR in Duluth, Minnesota, on its 30th anniversary on NBC, which is very, very nice. Congratulations. 30 years on the network. Well, you've almost been on, that, on your network that long, haven't you? Nine, nine years. Nine years on yeah. Love Boat. That's, mm -hmm. a, that's really a long time. Uh, I'll take a couple, you know what I mean? It'd be very nice. $300 puzzle coming your way if you're ready to go. Laurie and Fred giving the clues, and let's get on with it. First word, please. Laurie. Thin. Slim. Fred. Lean. Skinny. Yes. Yeah. Thought we were gonna have a little trouble there for a minute. I don't know why. Skinny is the word. Robert, for the game, for you. Is it Twiggy? Is it Twiggy? Ooh, great Child guess. Was the 60s. <clears throat> yes, well, Twiggy's still doing great. Here we go. Next and word, she's please. And put on weight. And great. gained a little weight, <laughs> gained a pound or two. Fred, please. <clears throat> Bolshoi Ballet. Yes, perfect play. Very good. Skinny Ballet, sir. Is it my guess? No. no. Robert, well, don't look at me like that. Why am I looking at you for the game, Robert? Is it a prima ballerina? Is it a prima ballerina? Hmm. hmm. Skinny ballet, eh? Next word, please. Short I don't know what that means. It means. Aha, Fred. Do so. Nancy. Yes, oh, that's great, Fred. <laughs> nice going. Skinny, Ballet, and Nancy for the game, Robert. Is it Reagan? Is it Reagan? <laughs> oh, I'm terribly sorry. <laughs> Two people out there brokenhearted over that. <laughs> Next word, please. All right, Fred. <clears throat> Reagan. Ronald. Laurie. Office. President. Yes. Yeah. Too bad. Okay. Skinny, ballet, Nancy, and president, and you need this one to stick around, Rosemary. Is it Ronald Reagan's son? I have no idea. Is it Ronald it, Reagan's son? Is it Ronald Reagan's son? Oh. Yes, they're giving it to you. Ronald Reagan Jr. Oh. You didn't need kid. <laughs> That's exactly correct. You're absolutely Thanks. right. And now we have a tie game, and we'll come back and break that tie with the $400 puzzle right after this commercial. Don't go away. That's what it goes. Uh, $300 for $300. Oh, here we go. We have a tie, $300 for Robert and Rosemary. $400 puzzle, the winner plays $5,000. If you're ready to go, Rosemary and Robert, you've got the little television set. Take a look at the word. We'll show the folks at home what that word is, and Robert, you'll start. Threatening. Okay, Rosemary? Hazardous. Dangerous. Oh, it's a perfect clue. Excellent clue. Dangerous. Dangerous, and every guess is for the game now. <laughs> is it um, the Old West? Is it the Old West? No kidding. No. <laughs> the Old Vic. <laughs> <laughs> okay. The Old West. Yeah. I sounded like Don Adams. Is it the Old West? <laughs> Thank you very much. Next word, please. Rosemary? Dark time. Uh, musketeer. Yes. Yeah. Another great clue. Oh, good. Perfect. Dangerous musketeer. Um, Dangerous musketeer. For the game. Is it a sword? Is it a sword? Oh! <laughs> Didn't need 
Sharp didn't need Flynn didn't need <laughs> nothing. Unbelievable. <laughs> what are you gonna do about that? Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> Not bad, Handler. <laughs> My goodness. Congratulations, Rosemary. Uh, Rosemary. Thank you. Robert, we have to say goodbye to you, but it's, as I always say, it's not with a heavy heart. You have amassed $38,600. Wow. Great good luck to you. Thank Thanks. You, nice to see you. Thank you, Fred. Let's go. Thank you, Come on, Dan. Well, that was something, wasn't it? Oh, that was. <laughs> I, I mean, I, I not for a million dollars. Well, maybe not for a million dollars. For five thousand, it's mm -hmm. it was worth the sword. Mm -hmm. Boy, that was great. Um, you've never been here before, Rosemary, but no. you know how we do it. Yes, I'm going to give you ten words beginning with the letter L and continuing through the letter U. Okay, L through U. Everyone, you get right. I'll give you a hundred dollars if you get them all. I will give you five thousand dollars. I'll take it. Okay. Thank you. You know how it is, right there. Of yep. course you do. Sixty seconds. Let's take a look at your first word, shall we? Here it comes on the board, and there it is. Got it? Ready? Okay. Good luck, Rosemary. Thank Ready you. Ready and go. Sucker. Lollipop. M. A wood. Maple. Dark. Mahogany. N. A, a dream. Nightmare. O. Round. Oval. P. A, a buccaneer. Uh, by pioneer. Uh, Pirate. Yes. Q. Uh, fight. Quarrel. Yes. R. A, grape. Raisin. S. Uh, uh, spa. Sauna. T. Uh, binoculars. Uh, uh, Stars. Uh, telescope. Viewer. Yes. You. Uh, cows. Utter. Yes. <laughs> wow. Boy, I tell you, you are so fast. Unbelievable. Oh. Nice going up and <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Isn't that fun? Yes. <laughs> you did, huh? Oh, yes. oh great. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, great. Well, I, you had 19 seconds left. I'm telling oh, you, you are so fast. <laughs> well, you only had to give two clues, I think, once or twice, yeah. maybe just that telescope. fast. I couldn't get the t -t 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 telescope. <laughs> telescope, but you didn't. You had plenty of time. You could have said it 10 more times, as a matter of fact. You won 5000 You now have $5,700. <gasps> We'll break away. We'll come back in just a moment with some more super powerful after this birthday. That's a kill, isn't it? You got it. Oh, God. You got it. There we go. Hell oh, yeah. We are back. Well, we've had an exciting win, and it is exciting, Rosemary. Oh, you can't. Have, I get yes. excited too, and I don't get anything, but uh, but it's a lot of fun. Oh yeah. Here's a, here's a gentleman coming back that we've seen before. Come on in, Jerry. Won't you? He's your challenger. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Hi, Jerry. Nice to see you again. I should explain that Jerry was here with us once before, and. Uh, and we made a mistake. Uh, we never do that. It must be very rare, of course. But we did make uh, an error, and we, in, in all fairness, we brought you back to give you another chance. And of course, when he left here, he had $22,000, so uh, Jerry's going to do fine. You get another shot, Jerry. Thank you, Tell thank you. Tell us about yourself once again, please. My name is Jerry Hoffman. I'm a law student, and I'm real happy to be back. Yes, well, I can understand why. <laughs> okay, now you've been over the end game uh, three times, I believe, so yeah. you can still go, just two more times, you can get over there, and then you're out of here, okay? Okay. Okay. Uh, <laughs> That's a deal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, if you're, you're ready to go, uh, we're ready to go. Here's a $100 puzzle, gang, and let's do it. Fred and Laurie giving the clues, and off we go. Fred, please. Sacred. Holy. Yes. That's the way. Okay, Jerry, what could that be? Uh, communion. Is it communion? <laughs> no. Okay, here we go. Next word, please. And there it is, Fred. Scriptures. Bible. Yes. <laughs> Holy Bible. Jerry? New Testament. Is it the New Testament? <laughs> no. Okay, next word, please. <laughs> hmm, Fred? Section. Chapter. All right, Laurie? He said section. Um, section. Verse? No. Oh, Fred? Peace. Page? All right, fourth and final clue. Cart? Book? Oh, she was going for a rhyme on the last one. It was part. 
part. The word was part. We put it yes. on the board and nobody guesses. They say you only use rhymes in desperation. Yes. Well, <laughs> <laughs> you picked the right moment. The holy Bible and part, and off we go. Nobody guesses. Next word, please. All right, Fred, you're still up. Ocean. C. Yes. <laughs> holy Bible part C. Jerry. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, 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 yeah. Here we go. Next word, please. <laughs> Fred? <clears throat> Individual. Moses. Laurie? Human. Person. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. Holy Bible, heart, sea, and person, Rosemary. Is it Moses? Is it Moses? Yeah. Yes. You jumped the gun. Okay. Moving our monitors out is what we're doing. This is the $200 puzzle. The cash word is worth $2,000. And Rosemary and Jerry, you're given the clue, so start us off, please. Here comes the first word. There it is, Jerry. Peaceful. Quiet. All right. Rosemary. Hostile. Warring. All right, Jerry. Angry. Noisy. Fourth and final, Rosemary. Dangerous. Hostile. They said that, no. didn't they? No, the word was violent. Ah, okay. Well, Put it on the board, and nobody guesses on that one. All right, next word, please. Okay. Show the folks at home what it is. And off we go. Jerry, please. Manhattan. New York. Yes. Yeah. Violent. New York, Fred. Bernard Getz. <laughs> Is it Bernard Getz? <laughs> God, I thought that was it. Certainly qualifies there, <laughs> as a matter of fact. Off we go. Next word, please. Jerry. Whoa. <laughs> okay, Rosemary. Mm. Lynch mob. Yeah. Tried to sneak it in there, you little devil. <laughs> All right, two words there. It doesn't qualify, Jerry. Posse. Crowd. Okay, fourth and final. Grassroots. Vigilante. Yes, we're looking up, uh, we're looking up grassroots. Is what we're doing. Oh, come on. That's not, that's not that's, one word. That's one word. word. From the that's one word. That's one word. They're saying one, they're holding up one. The... Vigilante. Yeah. Then it's good. <laughs> on the board. Violent New York vigilante. It's, uh, is it the subways? As Bill Bernard gets. Is it subways? <laughs> no. And besides Bernard Gett. Well, well, that's obviously the answer. There's something I else coming up here, maybe. Here we go. Next word, please. Mm. Rosemary. Charles. Seabert. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Sorry. Avenue. <laughs> Street. Okay. Rosemary. Actor. <laughs> Madison. Oh. Oh. Okay, Jerry. Phew. Charles. Okay, that was the fourth and final one. The, the, the answer is Bronson, Charles, that's oh. what they were going for. So we have violent New York vigilante in Bronson and nobody guesses. Here comes the last clue, the last word. And there it is, Rosemary. Movie. Film. Okay, Jerry. Movie. Um, show. Rosemary. Fine. Flick. Yes, that's the clue. <laughs> Violent New York vigilante Bronson Flick. Is it Death Wish? Is it Death Wish? Yes. I could not think of a title of that movie to save myself. Absolutely correct. Well, it took them all to get it. All right, Rosemary, you are in the lead, $300 to zero at this point, and we're going to come back and play the cash for it after this uh, commercial message. Don't go away, please.
That was a tough game. We'll see you tomorrow right here on Super Passport. Thanks for watching, everybody. Goodbye. This is Gene Wood speaking for Super Password, a Mark Goodson television production. <laughs>